Can I grab another one? Do that. I, I don't even have to sit down. I'm, I'm that professional. Oh my god! Hello everyone, my name is Lucifer and welcome to Gimmick, which is supposed to be an alien autopsy game. Which I think is very cool. Dave97 at 4IT at email IT dot com. There's a lot of ITs. Listen, I like IT as much as the next person, but that is a lot of IT. That is too much IT in there. Assistance needed for data transfer at the lab. Dear David, I hope this email finds you well. I am reaching out to you on behalf of our team. We are facing a critical situation in our lab and we require your expertise to assist with us a data transfer task. We have a PC in our lab that contains crucial information and we need it to transfer data onto a floppy disk for backup purposes. That's so archaic. Everyone knows that we use magnetic tapes, not floppy disks, which also actually use magnetic tapes, so I'm, I'm just being stupid and redundant. Okay. We believe your assistance will be invaluable. We kindly request you to come down to our lab at your earliest convenience. The equipment and necessary tools are already set up. Thank you in advance for your assistance. Best regards, Peter. Uh, send? Can I send it? I mean, it says send over here, which means it's not sent yet, which means... Oh, I was playing as a person who was sending it, and now I'm playing as David. Hello. Oh. I don't know if this is going to get all mortuary assistant in here. This is a nice lab. This is a very cool lab. That's so cool. I have a big inkling that I need to turn the thing on very soon. The foose box. The foose box is important. Oh, this is... This feels like a running around room. Just, just the layout of it. Oh, coffee! <gasps> I can get coffee! I mean, tea is obviously better, but you know, when, when when in doubt, you drinky winky the coffee waffy. Oh, that is chain, and that's not good. And I'm gonna die if I read this, aren't I? Well, let's do it. Class classified report alien autopsy classification level top secret. Report ID NA three eight seven zero four one three. The extraterrestrial entity has a unique physiological characteristics not found in any other organism. Its skin exhibits a smooth green texture devoid of hair or external features. The tissue samples reveal a complex cellular structure with unfamiliar molecular compositions. The alien has a physical structure which resembles humans with four limbs and yet no sensory organs. An internal examination revealed a centralized nervous system, a single organ resembling a brain. Further examination is inconclusive. That's really cool how they like have a whole like a SCP kind of thing. Also a really funny thing to me is like how in almost you know, like every like fantasy world, humans tend to become the baseline for all descriptions. Like in D&D, for example, uh, humans are, everyone are called humanoids. One, because, you know, we are humans as the players and it's easier to just call humanoids because we are the general shape. But in D&D, it's because humans are like a virus. They have popula they have populated so much in like the areas that they've basically become the base standard for all research and everything because there are just so many of them, right? So it's absolutely hilarious just how humans are like that. Uh, all right, let's go do the data transfer task. Uh, I want to check up on alien once more. Oh, good, good, very good. Actually, I, I, I haven't gotten here. Hello? Are you in here? You're not in here, are you? I don't trust that you're in there. Hello, what is this? For the newcomers to the lab, I would say there is nothing to be feared. You must try to convince yourselves right from the start that we all fail. But I do have some suggestions on how to survive here. Firstly, have a good breakfast because that is the only thing you're going to eat. Second, you should stare deeply into the abyss of failure and impending existential crisis. Third, note everything you see, even if there is nothing noteworthy. And finally, remember to schedule a nap, Petter. Okay, well, I thank you for calling me a failure. I know, I know. My YouTube's not going anywhere, and I'm going to fail. That's fine. What if I do... Th oh. Oh my god! Fudge! What the fudge? Oh yes, grab him, grab him by the throat! D alien daddy. <laughs> oh, ending three, should not already classified. Ah, wait, what if I just- Wait, 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 I have question. What if I didn't read it? Oh, it goes to the desktop. That is lovely, I do love it going to the desktop. So like, what if I don't read the thing and I go outside? What then, huh? Is, is alien daddy gonna choke me by the necky wecky? <laughs> Is, is, is it gonna do that? Is it gonna do that? Is Alien Daddy gonna come right at me? Can I go out shy? Oh, ending one. David left the lab. It was not worth it after all. You right. You right. My 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 YouTube's not worth subscribing to and 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 liking the video. 
Let's do the task. I'm not sure what I have to do because, oh wait, I did see a thing over here. I don't know if the coffee is important, but I'm gonna assume that it's important to drink coffee because I need to case it and to stay at, to pay attention. I'm not reading that, you're a trap. I will now take my coffee, drink it and pretend it's tea. The only way I can drink coffee is by pretending that it's tea. All right, I've drunk my coffee. Can I get a nap now? I'm really sleepy. Yeah, I'm so sleepy. I want a nappy wappy all over me. All right. Software manual. In order, in order to transfer data onto a floppy disk, you need to follow these, these simple steps. Sit in the chair. Do not take tasks standing like an idiot. Turn on the computer but the box on your left. Uh, once the monitor is on, take the floppy disk. Insert the floppy disk into the disk drive below, below monitor. Click on the keyboard just to confirm stuff. <laughs> Wait for the data transfer. Meanwhile, look around and get some coffee. Uh, I don't care. Once the transfer is complete, remove the floppy disk and place it near, near where the laptop is going to do the main server. It will highlight which one. Don't worry about it. Good luck and stay safe. Uh, what he, what he's in the chair? Turn the computer on. Okay. Uh, how do I turn you on? I, I, you obviously can tell by me not knowing how to turn you on that I don't know how to turn you on. Uh, take a floppy disk. Is the floppy disk? Okay. Take the floppy disk. Oh, I took a floppy disk. Uh, into the monitor. Right. This, this makes no sense because technically this is the computer, but then this also has this. So it makes no sense. I have confirmed stuff for you, my liege. Uh, wait for the data transfer. Meanwhile, look around and get some coffee. I don't care. All right, I'm going to get some coffee. Hope nothing has moved in here. Oh, nothing has moved at all. Oh, you would not be a bad alien and move around, would you? All right, so that's that's that, that's fine. Everything seems fine. I've drunk my coffee. Everything seems cool. Everything seems fine. I don't get more coffee. Well, that's true. Tea is obviously better, so obviously I don't get more coffee. Can I call my loved ones and friends? No, you're right. I don't have any. Okay, once the transfer is complete, put it over there. I did it. Um, did I do it? Did I do a dumb it? Uh-huh. I feel like I've done it. I just have this feeling that I've done it. How am I sure you ask? I don't know. I just have this feeling. Oh. Okay, I need to do it for every single floppy disk. Okay, all right. I can do that. I can do so one for every laptop. That. I would prefer no noise, please. I like my place nice and quiet and silent. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna be running around, aren't I? Oh! Oh, I hate that. Oh, I hate that. Oh, wow, there's another note there now. Lovely. Um, what? Why are there lungs? Why are there lungs? Excuse you? A purple pipe. Lovely, I heard that. I'm gonna go to the laptop really quickly, but... Something strange is happening around here. Peter seems a bit off. At the last autopsy, he claims that he can hear someone whispering, talking to him. I have a weird feeling that it is somehow connected to our research. There are things that we do ar around here which we cannot disclose outside in public. Maybe he feels that pressure. Yesterday, he told me to stay late and asked me if I was willing to do anything in order to keep this job. I was scared, but it was a very important meet to me to have this job. Lab assistant. Oh, Peter, how, how, how are you, Peter? Doing good, Peter? Huh, Peter? You doing good, buddy? Grab that. Place that there. Can I grab another one? Do that. I, I don't even have to sit down. I'm, I'm that professional. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. La, 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 I'm just practicing my song that I do on the weekends to a coffee shop. I betrayed the tea friends because I was not supposed to do it in a coffee shop. I apologize. The meaty lungs are still here of the alien daddy. Oh no, oh no. Oh no. Well, at least this, this happened pretty fast. Okay, that is not good. Don't hit me with the pipe. You're gonna hit. Oh, sh uh, right. So this is a coffee machine. Coffee machines. Coffee machines are scary. Coffee machines are very, very terrifying. 
Hello. 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 My name is Lucifer. <sighs> this purple pipe is all over the place. Anyways. Okay. I clicked on stuff. It is happening. Yummy, yummy. I would love more tea. I mean coffee. I mean cuff tea. Tea fee. Okay. I dislike... Oh, wait. What was that? was this? Don't like that. Don't like that at all. Uh, what was that? I heard a growl. I don't know if I'm just hearing things at this point, but I heard a growl. I am so sure that I heard a growl. Oh boy, everything is a-okay. Everything is a-okay and nothing is wrong at all. You have Lucy's stamp of approval of everything being okay. That's right, this has Lucy's stamp of approval of being okay. Yeehaw the Mima, that's what I say. Leave the laboratory. Okay, I heard that once more. I dislike all of this. Okay. Ah, you, you completed a given task, safe and unharmed. You know me. I'm a failure, apparently, so, you know, that's fine. I'm gonna leave it that way, that way, the way, the way, the way, the way, the way. Uh, that was fun. That was, I can see that it being expanded upon. Um, this feels like, it could be like a FNAF game, uh, FNAF type game where you gotta sit in a computer while it's downloading or you're, you, you do some puzzles to push the download. And you have some alieny kind of things in the um, uh, room, which the researchers, researchers happen upon. And as you're downloading it to protect yourself from the aliens, I think that has, this has a lot of potential, or even like a mortuary assistant kind of game. Like the aliens are there. You have, to, you, have, you have to do the research while also maintaining the copying of the thing. And some supernatural stuff happens, like oh, some alieny stuff happens. And I think this has so much more potential than what it is. And it is, it's obviously a basic game. That's fine. I played this person's game before. Um, I think it was uh, Passerby. And it, it, it's scary. It's scary. Even, you know, with uh, the way it looked and everything like that, I think it, it was pretty cool. Uh, it just had that unnerving feeling to it. So, but I, and I feel like this could be extended upon. This could be done a lot more. And yeah, that's about it. Thank you, everyone. So much more. I'll see you in the next video. Take care and goodbye.